Last time. Oh boy. Ooh, ooh, you motherfucker. This time. Well, uh, we're in the attic. And welcome back. Um, just gonna keep trucking right along. I noticed in the last video there's this... There's this noise, this humming, buzzing noise, just uh, the entire way through the game. And I know it's just an ambient noise that's within the game because I'm hearing it right now, but it's so loud, especially in certain parts of the game. And I'm not the best with audio. Um, I was trying to level it out the entire time with between that and the... Um, and the dialogue in the game, in my own dialogue, and it's uh, just very hard to, <laughs> very hard to balance, especially when you don't know what you're doing. 25. Uh, so I do apologize about all the noise. Oh. I'm, I'm <laughs> yeah, it is. It's a funny looking picture, but uh, Giovanni Maxwell, 56 years old. Yeah, I'm um, trying the uh, controller. I'm so used to playing with keyboard and mouse that I'm grabbing the, the wrong things. I'm just opening inventory like an idiot. Controls are a little strange, but... Oh, that's Grandma and Grandpa, I believe. Oh, hang on, let's just read it. Age is just a number you can add or subtract, but at the end of the day, when the time comes, you die anyways. Add or subtract. Okay, well, that's highlighted, so that's important. Oh. Let's see what this has to say. Thirteen. The other was twenty-five, right? I think. 25. Okay. So what 38 is what? You can add 38. Five years old. Five years old. Oh, Maxwell. Oh, 43. That means demons. All right. Well, I think I might be missing something, but I thought I might be able to pull that up with the hammer. But I guess not. So I'm just going to go back down for a moment. If I need to, I'll come back up real quick. It didn't immediately let me go down into the basement last time. This is still blacked out. Oh my god. We got a key to Grandma and Grandpa's room. I don't know if I want to see what this place is getting out in store for me. Oh, more pictures of what a mess. Demon Grandma and a bunch of pills. That's a lot of pills. That's a lot of blister packs. Let's see, what's this? Ooh. I'm gonna read your diary, Grandma. March 22nd, 1972. They say that having a diary is good for the brain. Well, we'll see how this goes for me then. March 29th, 1972. See, today we went to a garage sale near the center. I found a book of very good recipes. Johnny came back happy with the book, too. He was very excited about it. It was a good day indeed. And April 1st. I woke up in the middle of the night. Again, I swear there was someone staring at me in the corner of the room. 
Oh boy. April 3rd. Today I found all my jewelry scattered all around the room and my wedding ring inside the kitchen sink. I asked Johnny what he was looking for, but he swears he didn't touch a thing. April 5th. We had the, to bring Johnny to our bed once again. The book we bought him only causes him nightmares. We have to admit that it's a little scary, though. April 9th. My jewelry is out of place again. I cannot find my wedding ring. It was the cutest gift all Albert ever gave me, but today Johnny was a hello wasn't at home. Sometimes I feel as if there was someone else in the house watching every step I make. Albert tells, Albert tells me not to worry. He might think I'm starting to go crazy. April 10th. What a relief. I found the ring in John's room. Honestly, I don't know what to think. Oh my goodness. April 11th. I didn't get any sleep last night. I could not get that stupid tale of the eyeless monster out of my head. I don't know why we bought him that shitty book. Not sure. I'm not sure why you bought him that shitty book. Uh, let's see. I haven't written for a long time. These weeks have been from a doctor to another. And something is wrong with my eyes. They don't know what is happening to them. My sight is getting blurrier each day and it hurts a lot. God, doctors says... Doctors says <laughs> that I've lost more than 40% of my sight in these last weeks. I find it hard to read, write, watch TV, even think of other things. My pupils are kind of erasing from my eyes. May 23rd. I'm tired of medications. Nothing seems to help. I cannot stand the pain anymore. Why is this happening to me? It's extremely hard for me to move around the house with my eyes like this. I cannot stand the pain anymore. God help me, please. I'm really scared. I know there's someone in the house, but nobody believes me. I know it's true, even though I cannot see it. I feel the presence. There's someone living among us. Uh, among us? Hmm. I know there's someone in the house. I heard noises all night long. I'd swear I heard someone breathing while trying to get a glass of water. I lost more than 80% of my sight. Doctors say they no longer see any solution. I don't want to be alone in the house anymore. I'm not safe here. My ring is out of place again, but it doesn't matter. No, nobody will be able to find it now. I just hid it underneath. Don't you know Among Us is a dead game, Grandma? We got here. I don't know, man, but her pupils just disappeared from her eyes. That's creepy. Sorry about the eyesight, Grandma. Uh, so let's see. What are these? There are meds everywhere. Yeah, there there are definitely a lot of those. Let's open you up and take a peek. Locked. Some kind of slides. Okay, I'll take them. I don't know why that other side's locked, but whatever. That's locked too. Oh, ocular depth exam for Elizabeth Maxwell cataracts diagnosis. Strange type of cataracts. So both eyeballs are turning completely white. The patient loses her sight progressively in short periods of time. Ocular damage percentage: right eye ninety-five percent, left eye eighty-seven percent. We cannot define neither assure what is happening with the patient's eyes. Please continue with the medications as up to date uh, while we find a proper treatment. Next visit in July 26th, 1972. Ooh. Grandma went to visit on my birthday, July 26th, not 1972, but I am still pretty dang old. Um, let's see. Lots of pictures off the walls. Pictures on the ground. What happens if I do this? Oh. Huh. Well, that's interesting. Okay. Um. I guess we're moving on from the room. I think I looked at everything in here. Aha. Uranus and Neptune. Wait, so is this supposed to be... I don't know. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Let's see. I don't have the <laughs> the other medallion as it is. Oh. This slides. Why can't I slide it? Weird. Oh, boy. Ah. Uh. 
my son is waking up. I'll be back. All right. Well, false alarm, I think. So we're uh, just going to continue moving right along here. This is a different... Oh. I'm an idiot. Okay. Hey, another tape. Hello. There we go. I guess we'll go, uh... Play tape to... Hello. Oh. Royal. That's locked. And you're gonna block me from this hallway, huh? Oh. I'm gonna get you. You can't run for me, you're a statue. Who do you think you are? Oh, hey. Oh, my goodness. Let's just turn that off, why don't we? See, that is so loud that it, like, drowns out his voice. Right. Well, that statue is definitely trying to run away from you. So that's a lot of videotapes. Oh, oh, that scared me. I wonder what kind of uh, weird videotapes Grandma and Grandpa would record. Oh, these thingies. in there. Nice. Next. Uh-huh. Next. Grandpa? Dead. Little tyke. Is that coffins? What is that? Hang on. Well, this is a sweet room, but your sofa's a little close to the screen. And my mom always said that if I sat too close to the screen, my eyes would cross and they'd stay that way. Oh, hey. Why can't I... Good lord, there we go. 1968. Poor grandpa. Oh my god, yeah, how can you sit this close? There is pictures on the floor, though. So let's take some photos. No, I don't think that's a good photo. Yeah, probably about 68, right? Something like that. Not even a door over here. Oh. 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 I'm gonna take a picture whenever that happens. There we go. At the last planet. Look at that. Oh, hey, and there's the, uh, there's the order. Okay. So, Jupiter. No, at the end. Copy that. Alright, so, well, just give me this. Thank you. Oh, hey, statue. Welcome back. Very nice of you to join me again. Yes, and this is not the proper solar medallions that I need to use here. And there's another statue. Let's see. 
High statue. Oh, hey, look. 33 years old. Pesquel Maxwell. Oh, Grandpa. All this time, we thought he went mad. But he only wanted to talk to her again. No, it's kind of kind of sad actually. Oh grandpa. Let's see. If you need the combination, you know where to find it. Oh. On the clock. Joseph Abraham Leakster. I read rune cards, tarot cards, and connect to past loved ones in the spirit world. Direction, clarification, guidance, and outcome via tarot and runes. Contact 212-56-544-84512. What the hell kind of number is that? Liar. Oh boy. Didn't help you out, huh? Alright. Well, let's get... There we go. Why the red light? And welcome back again. <gasps> oh shit. Flash didn't even happen. Well, let me just gonna I don't have to poop that bad. If I do, I'll just poop my pants. Okay. Now it's cool, though. Alright, how about you? Can I go in here yet? Cannot. Okay. Alright. Oh, 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 God! You... Stop that statue. Hey... Why don't you go back to your little hovel there? Let me climb up here and I'll take a look at the clock. Let me pop this picture in its spot. There we go. Looking good. And then we've got the hexagon there. Alright. Is that a hexagon? Whatever it is. We're going back down. I guess I should have probably just grabbed everything before I did that, but... I'm, uh... Oh. Statue. Why? And you... Ah, there we go. Now you're moving. Hey, Grandma. I'm just going to take this hammer and remove these boards and go into her... Hey, there's the last photo. Go to Grandpa's shrine here. You know, Grandpa, some things are best left in the past, my dude. I know it's painful, but this is how you get demons. Hey, Grandpa. 68 years old. Wait, no, this isn't Grandpa. Philomena. Huh, hey. Ooh. So Grandpa tried to contact Grandma with this thing? Is that blood? Yeah, that's a bloody thumbprint. Okay. Alright. Well, Grandpa. What the hell is happening? Something's... Oh, shit. Happening. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. You trying to keep me from doing things? Because, I mean... No, that's wrong, actually. I just... Let me... Close that real quick. 
Let me listen to this tape. And pop that in there. Becoming possessed by a wicked entity. And here we go. Signified by a loss of control over the body, mind, and the soul. However, that is often not enough for the entity. It hungers for more. Things get much worse for the host. In these cases, possession is just the first step of the demon's plan. It is said there are those that return to our world seeking to resolve unfinished matters from their mortal lives. The victims of these wicked possessions are subjected to a departure of sorts. An astral transportation, for lack of a better word. Astral what? These malicious beings force their hosts to, to live moments that shouldn't be possible in a different place and time, perhaps even in a different dimension altogether. It's madness. It's unclear whether these transportations occur inside the mind or if the host is physically taken to some alternative reality. Alternative reality? Um, well, you, oh God, that is, oh my God. Holy shit. I do not- why would I want to walk over here? Fuck, there's a naked old woman there. Oh god, okay. Well. <gasps> oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh fuck. <laughs> Some gnarly stuff, buddy. Let's go up to the attic. We'll put we're putting that last photo in. Oh god damn, that's so creepy. That's so scary. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Ugh. Alright. And uh is there anything I can use but that yet? Yeah, no, I don't At this point I'm just oh my god, okay. All right. Well, now what? What was this one? Did I not take a picture? It's okay, I did. Thirteen. Let's grab you. Take a photo. Ten. 10, 13, behind the oval. 38, behind the hex. 25, behind the triangle. So let's see. 38 behind you would equal 43. 5 plus 38. 43. Okay. Okay, so you go here. So we're trying to equal these all up to 43 by either addition or subtraction. My god, I went off on a there, and then I just have to put you here. Yep. Okay, I get it. And we go. And there's a door. Oh god. Oh sh Well I think it's safe to say I can go through there now. Don't have what I need for these clocks, I don't know. Alright. Small victories. We got something here. What is this? Oh. Oh 
god. Yeah, okay. And water. Oh boy. Yeah, I see that. I was just about to comment on that. There are definitely handprints in the walls. Oh boy, how lovely. What a fun attic adventure. What? Luca is not here. There's no one here by that name. I don't know why I'm doing this. Why can't I just move the piano out of the way and walk out the front door? How about that? Oh my god. Oh no. I... Okay. Oh. Hey. Nope. Nope. Luca is not here. I got some of those red photos and some of the uh, cut content from the previous video. Oh my god, this is so fucking terribly terrifying. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, I can still take pictures. Oh boy. This is... awful. Is it really worth trying to figure out what's going on in this house? <gasps> oh, you motherfucker. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Okay. Why would I don't... Oh my god. That scared the Nikes out of me. Oh my god, this game is terrifying. Can't go that way. I don't know where the hell to go. Guess I should just. <gasps> ooh, 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 ooh. Oh no. Oh god. Oh boy. Oh shit, I can't handle this shit. <laughs> you dirty, dirty motherfucker. Oh, you goddamn nasty ass woman. I don't know why I'm trying to follow you and your old nasty waterlogged water bag boobies. Ugh. Every time, it makes me jump. So straight ahead is a dead end. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. You fucker. Oh my god. Ugh, oh, god damn. Why do I do this to myself? I don't understand why I do this to myself. Who am I even entertaining at this point? I can't even keep track of where the hell I'm going. This bitch is fucking with me. Oh. Oh shit. So I'm gonna go right then, I guess. Hey, I see something. I see a way out. Oh my god, I feel like I've been... Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I mean, thanks, I guess, for sh showing me the way out. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh. I don't want to make out with you. I'm happily taken. 
please. <laughs> oh god. Let's get the hell out of here. Oh good, crosses. Yeah. Oh boy. Yep, I gotta get out. Holy shit. That took way too long. Oh my god. What the fuck? Holy shit. Oh, hey crows. Where you at? Got a nice shiny nickel for you. We can be friends. I would love to befriend a crow. Let me see this. Patricia Dad Nitty. Well, I don't mind graveyards so much, but uh, should I be doing anything in particular? I guess generally going in the right direction. Yeah. The bells say. The bells tell me that yes, I'm I'm going the right direction. And this lovely piecemeal walkway we have here. No. Oh. This place seems abandoned. Well, it's probably not even real, buddy. This was all under your grandpa's house. Tell ya. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. This is way too far down, my dude. What am I doing? Oh, 